So let's talk about how to get more bookings and you might just get, be getting started or you're probably in the middle of the year or you've just been in the game for a few months, maybe a couple years and you're just looking to optimize your turtle bookings to get more reservations. Maybe in your marketplace, it's not as hot, your car has been sitting. This is just for people to automatically get instant bookings and I've experimented with this so many times. So I'll give you guys a few things on how we do it. So let's tap in. I'm a Las Vegas power host on the platform with over 20 plus vehicles. We're selling cars, buying cash cars. We're doing a lot of stuff, been doing this for over 14 months now and we've scaled it quick. I've ran several different businesses. I'm still running different businesses. So Turo just kind of came into the mix. It looked hot in the Vegas marketplace. So if you have a marketplace where there's a lot of competition, it's actually a good thing because it means it's working. So you just throw your car onto the platform and you're pretty much gonna get bookings, okay? At least this is our experience. Everybody else I'm hearing, this is probably one of the most simplest business models to get started in the car rental space. Now, let me just share a few things that we do if you're just trying to get bookings. Maybe you're starting off and you're kind of like scared that you're not gonna get bookings. Here are ways, obviously, uh, we've optimized it differently. Everyone's gonna be different, but these are just ways to for sure get bookings. So you can just get the experience and figure out, start building up your listings onto your actual like car. So, you know, oh, now your car got 10 trip, 12 trip, because the more trips, the more social proof. I know there's a lot of uh, different renters that actually look at that stuff and they're like, yeah, this is why they're trustworthy or they, you, you actually get more reviews. So this could be for somebody that's just starting off because this is what we did. And no, I'm not gonna tell you to lower the price. You can lower the price and do price wars with a competition or people in your marketplace, but there's other ways to optimize your listing. The first way is to offer delivery. I get it, not everyone has the luxury to do it. I know it might be inconvenience for a lot of people that are probably working full time and then they can't do deliveries or there's a way for you to pay somebody based off the deliveries per delivery. This is great. Offering deliveries will increase the likeliness of you getting bookings, okay? If you can, great. There's ways to optimize in the system where if somebody asks for a delivery at a specific location, then they have to ask you that when they book it to get that approved and you can either approve it or deny it. That's a way to get bookings, okay? Just by doing deliveries. Another one is by doing free deliveries. So again, if you have the luxury to do that or maybe cheaper delivery, some people like us, we do 120 per delivery. I don't care where you're at. You could be a block or a couple miles away where you charge for deliveries anywhere outside of home base. Why? Because it's inconvenience for us. We have to get two people to go out. So it slows down whatever the other person's doing, but we have the luxury. We offer deliveries anywhere and everywhere. That's just us because we have the luxury. We already have the team set in place. Deliveries and free deliveries will definitely give you more bookings. Another thing that other people do when it comes to like the daily rate on, uh, for miles, what Turo does is it gives you a minimum and this is the lowest you can offer is 200 miles per day. So let's say somebody booked it for four days, 200 times four, they have 800 miles in four days with a vehicle or else they won't get charged plus mile after that. Turo, they charge a few cents. I'm not sure the exact cents, it's, it's always been changing. I think it's like around 25, like a quarter per mile that they go over the booking and that gets charged after you calculate it on and uh, through the trip. So minimum is 200 or you could go unlimited miles per day. Now, you're definitely gonna get people that if they see that it's unlimited miles, those people, those guests are looking for unlimited miles. So the depreciation on the vehicles, obviously, you know, there's, there's a lot of factors to going more than just 200 miles per day. That's just me. I want renters that, hey, if they're gonna, if they're gonna go for a weekend, just go for, just rent it for three or four days if you're gonna go to Cali and, and put 500 miles on our car. You know, that, I might as well just do that instead of one day trip to Cali and you put 500, 1,000 miles for one day's trip, you get paid off after all the, all the fees and everything, what, 25, 30, $40 just for that, just for somebody to put 500 to 1,000 miles. I don't think it's worth it, okay? I'm telling you all the downside, but if you just absolutely need bookings and you wanna test the car, test the vehicle, start building up the listing, Starting off, we offered free delivery. We didn't do unlimited mileage, but these are things that optimize it so you can get more bookings if you wanna get more bookings on the Turtle platform. Thanks y'all, hopefully you guys enjoy this. So it has to do with delivery, optimizing that, unlimited mileage per day on the vehicle. These are things that you add, and when you're just starting off and you're just trying to build your account, get more reviews, get the Turtle platform to say, hey, you know, this person's getting their car booked all the time, right? So let's keep bumping up their listing in the algorithm. Let's show it to more people. 
this will just be a way to just jumpstart you and boost you, especially if you're just getting started. So those are just a few things. If you guys want to know more hacks, I didn't want to double dip and share with you guys other hacks, but these are more optimized hacks. Watch this video, check this out. It'll show you the optimized hacks that I would recommend to get more bookings as well and better customer experience. Y'all be blessed. Have a great week. I'll see you guys soon. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.